All right, little break time. Hey guys, Navtop here. I was doing a little tutorial of the SEMA quick release and it turned out to be a little bit more extensive than I was planning on. So that's gonna be put on hold for now. But while I was down here, I got the computer and I wanted to show you guys a little something you might not know about the internet. A little episode of things you didn't know you didn't know about avatars. So we're here on the noptop.com website. Let's just use this as an example. Click on Noptop Info. And this site's always under construction. All right, we're loading, loading, loading. There it is. All right, so we get down here, and you might have seen this before, where you'll get down to comments of a website, and you'll see some guys don't have icons by their names, and other guys do. Hey, well, that's called an avatar, and here's a little trick. Gravatar.com, and it's just this. A globally recognized avatar it uses your email address when you log in to leave a comment, and it links it with the photo you have set up with that email address. And I have this one set up, okay. <laughs> All right, so anyways, there it is. Gravatars, avatars, internet nerdiness. Something I thought a lot of you might not know about, and now you can put your face to your name. Knop top, things you didn't know you didn't know. And hopefully we'll get back to this quick connect SEMA tutorial. That'll be coming soon. When it's ready, you'll see a little annotation. All right, thanks for watching. See ya. I was thinking about it. What happens if that blank space gets scratched? Will the disc still play? And sure enough, it does. In fact, I did such an extreme experiment. I got magic marker, wrote all over this clear area, scratched it up with a key, and the disc still played. As long as there was no actual scratches or interruptions.